How are we doing guys? Today we're going to show you how to hook up a standard trailer with emergency hook pullout. Uh, basically so that you can safely tow the trailer. Alright, so what we have here, we use the number 5. Okay, so what we have is the hooks on the back of the truck. We have the cotter pin to make sure that the uh, tow ball stays in. Make sure that this is intact. On this side, I've already got the truck backed up and centered on the ball. Um, that's the tricky part, just making sure that's done. So what we'll do here is, first, we've got it centered on the ball. We're gonna go ahead and put on our safety chains. Into the hooks like this. You must make sure that the chains will not rub the ground. If you need to adjust the length on one, just twist it. Take a little length out of it. And you want to make sure that they're crossed. That way if anything happens and the trailer came is disconnected, that it'll cradle the trailer, the, the hitch for the trailer. All right. After that, we want to take this and plug in the seven point electrical connection we'll come over here this is the end for the emergency brake basically what happens here is we'll hook that on the same hitch as the safety chains and if this pulls out that means the brakes are on on the trailer and it'll bring it to a stop so that it doesn't go careening in traffic This one is pretty brand new. It's got a new battery in here. Make sure that our, we're connected inside there so that we don't, uh, so that we don't, um, you know, we have a break if we need it. Now we're gonna lower the trailer down like this. All the way up, foot all the way up. Until it stops. <sighs> I knew that was gonna happen. All right, so what we're gonna do, is we're gonna go back up here to the truck. We have to put a little tension on the uh, trailer so that we can lock the collar. Just a little. Now we'll come back here, seat the collar, make sure that there's a pin that goes through here. Flip that over so it doesn't come out. This is all your connections. 